This is the euphonium. It's uh, very similar to the tuba, so we'll do them both in the same section. Uh, the main body of the euphonium looks pretty much like this, and it only has one other piece, which is the mouthpiece. The mouthpiece, uh, to put the instrument together, goes straight in. You're going to put it in, and then you're going to turn it about a quarter turn, and that'll keep the mouthpiece in nice and tight. Then to get the mouthpiece out, you turn it a quarter turn, and it comes right out nice and easy. So the daily care and, and maintenance of the instrument, um, what you're going to want to make sure your child does is moves all, the, moves all the slides. In order to do that, have the child push down all of the valves, and then they just go through, and each slide goes in and out just a little bit. This helps prevent corrosion and keeps the slides from freezing up. And once they freeze up, then you have to go into the repair shop to uh, get them unfrozen. There might also be one on the back here as well, so just in and out on that. The other thing that you need to do for the daily care and maintenance is make sure the child um, uh, checks the valve caps as well. So just unscrews them a little bit, re-screws them. You want to do this for the same reason, uh, in order to keep the uh, corrosion from building up and uh, valve caps from freezing. Um, the last thing for daily uh, care and maintenance is you're going to want to have uh, the student make sure, that, make sure that the student oils their valves. In order to do this, you pull the valve out just a little bit. You have to unscrew the valve cap first. You pull the valve cap out, or pull the valve out, sorry. And um, you don't want to pull it all the way out because um, students tend to pull out multiple valves and then they get um, the valves mixed up. If the valves get mixed up, then the instrument won't work properly. So pull the valve out just a little bit, take some oil, just a few drops on the valve. I like to spin it around as it goes down to spread out the oil. And then the valve goes in, and we screw down the valve cap, and the valve should work nice and, nice and smooth. Uh, as your child is, is practicing with their instrument throughout the week, um, and they're moving their slides back and forth, it's important to note that if one of the slides starts to um, uh, become more difficult to move, or you hear more grinding of metal, then it's time to lubricate that slide. Generally, this only needs to be done once a week or so. Um, so what you're going to do is you have the student push down all the valves again, and they're going to pull the slide out. We can put the instrument down someplace safe. And then you're going to take your slide grease, and you're going to just distribute a little bit on each post. Okay, and just a nice thin line. And then you want to spread that out with your fingers. So that way the uh, grease gets um, is evenly distributed throughout the post. Okay. Once that's done, you take the euphonium and you're going to put the slide back in. Make sure again that you are pushing the valves down. And, and the slide is greased.